In today's video, I'm going to give you my six month update of using Finasteride. Stay tuned. Hey, my fellow follicle frontiers, my name is DJ from Carrots and Brotherhood. Welcome back to the channel. If it's your first time here, welcome. Carrots and Brotherhood is here to help you build confidence in your hair loss through transparency, empathy, and positivity. If you enjoyed today's content, make sure you click the subscribe button and also turn on the bell so you can get the notifications whenever I upload new content. Make sure you stay tuned to the end of the video, guys, where I include timeline photos from zero month until six months. You can kind of follow along just by pictures. So let's jump straight into the side effects. I have zero side effects still, guys. It's six months in. That includes sexual side effects. There's no sexual side effects on my end whatsoever. There's just nothing, so I'm not even gonna go into detail about what's not there because there isn't anything. So before I show you guys what's happening, I have no hair fibers in today. Okay, you can see I have no hair fibers in. My regimen to regrow hair includes not only finasteride, but also minoxidil and also dermarolin. I had a hair transplant in 2014, over 5,500 hairs transplanted into the top of my head. You know, if you look at the picture here, I had no hair on my head. I was very, very bald, you can see. And uh, so I had a hair transplant and got these hairs put in here, got the hairline fixed up. I got hairs put into about like right here. There's nothing implanted into the crown. My crown was still bald and it was bald for quite some time. And I started using minoxidil only. I used minoxidil and I got pretty good results from just using minoxidil. Back in 2018, I started derma rolling with a 0.5 derma roller, pairing that with a minoxidil and I got really, really good results. You can see in this picture here that I, I, you know, I got pretty good coverage considering that it had nothing to begin with. Now in 2018, my hair loss became quite aggressive. All of the hairs that I had regained from using the, the minoxidil and also the derma rolling, uh, had shed out and I was experiencing massive shedding. So I decided to get on finasteride and that was six months ago. Uh, during the first two months, I experienced very little regrowth. In the third month, I suddenly had a crazy amount of hair regrowth like on my crown and also just even like in here, like all this thickened up. But then into the fourth month and the fifth month, I started shedding like crazy guys, like, like scarily shedding. If you've checked out my previous videos, you, can, you remember just how aggressive the shedding was. I went from Wow, I have hair now to, oh my God, I'm back where I started. So that went on for month four and month five, and here we are at the end of month six, and I have zero shedding now. And I don't know if that's because I shed out all the hairs already and there's nothing else to fall out, but there's no more like the, the heavy shedding that I had. I am beginning to see a little bit of regrowth coming back because I started basically almost at square one. Um, I had lost everything that I gained on the finash right just because of the shedding. So let's go ahead and take a look at what six months on Finasteride looks like for me. I'll turn around so you guys can see. So as you can see, you can see the transplant scar here. As you can see, I got, uh, yeah, I got really thin again, like in this area, it's really thin again. But you can see that it's, even though it's thinned out because of the shedding, you can see that it's kind of still got the hairs there. Um, actually, this was looking far worse in month five, like really bad in month five. Uh, but there's there's hairs coming in, and I still have a lot of the hairs that grew in from the from the finasteride, like in this area here. Uh, all of this was bald, but this came back on the finasteride. Also down here, you can see these hairs are like thickening up. But just this area here is still pretty stubborn. Still waiting to see what's going to happen there. On the top here, you can see that I thinned out again, like right here, and I also started thinning out again right here. All of this is from the shedding. Okay, so the month four and month five shed just cleared all that out, dude, and it was really scary. I know some of the viewers in the comments were like, oh my god, see, I told you finasteride doesn't work, but I can't emphasize enough that finasteride is a long game, guys. It is not a short thing. I, I understand that it's going to take time, at least a year, to see, you know, what's going on. It may even take up to, you know, 18 months before I can see like the full regrowth. So am I worried? No. I mean, honestly, I don't check my hair as much as I used to. I make it a point not to check my hair daily. I know some of you like stay in the mirror and I've been there, especially when my hair loss first started, I was in the mirror every fucking morning, dude, like just looking at my hairline. So what does this mean for you? If you're taking Vanastride, especially if you're early in, you know, like when month two or month three, if you're not seeing anything happen, it's not necessarily a bad thing. Also, if you're not seeing any shedding, that's also not a bad thing. If you're seeing regrowth early, like three months, four months, I wouldn't get too excited because it's possible that the hairs would shed out anyway. Uh, understand that it's gonna take time, guys. And it goes the same for minoxidil, it goes the same for derma rolling, it goes the same for life in general. There's only a few things in life that are gonna get you instant gratification, and most of them are illegal. 
And I thank you so much for checking out the update videos. If you haven't seen my one, two, three, four, five month update videos, I have a playlist for those and I'll go ahead and link that here for you. So you can click that and check it out. That way you can follow my progress up until now. I'll be putting out another monthly update in month seven and continuing on until 12 months, okay? So I'm doing this for you guys so you can understand that you're not alone in this finash ride journey. Anyways guys, my name is DJ from Carrots Brotherhood. I'll see you guys in the next video.